All right, welcome back. Um, we are on Act 2, Scene 4 for me, 5 for you, um, starting on page 714. All right, Julia's been waiting a while for the nurse to get back, and um, hopefully you've read a little bit beforehand, because I'm not going to read this one to you. It did say read beforehand. Um, we're going to summarize this and just go through some of these points. Um, Juliet's a little upset. The nurse is taking a long time, and she's mainly blaming on the fact that the nurse is old. And if the nurse was young, she'd know how it would be able to wait for news like this, and she would hurry up. Yeah, that's pretty much her speech. All right. Um, and she finally walks in, but the nurse is not going to give her the news right away, because the nurse is going to mess with Juliet a little bit. It's just funny, because she knows how excited Juliet is to hear the news, and so she's going to just delay it a bit. Um, you know, she's, oh, she starts saying she's tired, she, her bones ache, and, you know, Juliet's still a little upset, the nurse says she's out of breath, Juliet says, how are you, how can you possibly be out of breath if you're saying you're out of breath? If you're, you can say you're out of breath and you're not out of breath, you should just give me my news. But again, the nurse is saying, no, no, no. All right. <clears throat> um, and goes on, goes on, goes on, goes on, goes on. It's just about to tell her, where is thy mother? All right. Um, why she is within, why should she be, how they'll reply is your love says, like an honest gentleman, where's your mother, you know, and then she threatens to not tell her the news at all because she's mocking her, all right, and then finally tells her what we already know is that you need to, this afternoon, go to Friar Lawrence's, tell your parents you're going for confession, and they'll be, oh, wow, how great she is, she's just a wonderful little Catholic girl. Off she goes to confession, um, and she's going to get married, and then here's this ladder that you need to like, roll down when you get home and Romeo can come up and they can have their marriage night because legally in the time period marriage was not considered a marriage unless it was consummated. I'm not sure what consummation means. Look that one up, but erase your internet history afterwards. All right. Um, act two, scene five. Um, this is the wedding scene. Um, mainly we just have some prophetic points that uh, Friar Lawrence is making um, that maybe we should just relax a little bit. These violent delights are violent ends and in their triumph die like fire and powder, which as they kiss consume, the sweetest honey is loathsome in its own deliciousness. Like too, there is such a thing as too much of a good thing. So relax a little bit, take it slow. Things that, well, it's like a firework, you light it, it's over, that's it. Put a long fuse on it, Romeo, all right? Okay, so Juliet's there, Romeo's there, and they're married. It's, it's a pretty short and sweet scene, um, and that's the end of that. Um, and then we'll come back for Act 3, Scene 1, in a different set of assignments later today or tomorrow. Maybe I'll sign off.